What's going on everyone? We're gonna jump right into Arena because this new deck that I've been using is just dominating everybody. Uh, I've won a lot of a lot of wins right now. Um, we'll go over that in a second, but what I have right here, I'm using the grid black cat combination if you didn't know. Uh, everyone knows what black cat does by now, but you move her and it picks up a fragment next to her. Well, with grid, you can, it moves an ally. So you drop down black cat, you get a nice one fragment. You drop down grid somewhere else, you get a fragment and you move her and she picks up another one. It's beautiful. It's amazing. You have two of them out, then expert espionage comes into play. You win the game right away. If you get two of their cards, you just win because you got Captain America up next, which will kill everybody, but I think, um, I think just a couple like Miss Mar or Captain Marvel and someone else, another leader, but maybe Thor. But yeah, you, nobody uses them anyway, so you pretty much kill everyone. So as you can see, I'm ranked fourth right now. Uh, I'm trying to get into top ten real quick. So let's get right into it. And sorry for the loudest birds in America. I don't know why at 7 at night in Florida these birds decide to do a mating call out here. Anyway, it's been taking me a long time to find... Oh, just kidding, we found one. So, let me show you what's going on here. We're playing my buddy Garlo. Okay. So, this is actually a good match here. Garlo is always one of the top players in the game, so it'll be fun. So, I want to get Black Cat, even though I know he's not going to let me do it. <laughs> oh, good, look at that. How awesome is that? Black Cat likes to just hide from me all the time. Sif, Mane, Expert Espionage, and Okoye. Okay. I'm going to use, um, I don't want to use grid in this instance because there's two spots. So they could go there or there. And if they go here, then I can't teammate, I can't team them up and kill them on the next turn, which is no fun. You always want to kill them in turn three if possible. Again, they're not going to let me. Uh, Garlor's a good player so he's gonna drop uh, man ape up top and kill my man ape which would be very mean so let's see what he's working with Thor he changed his deck since the last time I faced him okay so again he has expert espionage uh, he won't have it for a little bit actually because he just canned it so he does have destroyer um, so here's the instance uh, where black cat works out really well you have to do it from a distant person so i'm going to drop grid here and that's going to move black cat to one of the two spaces hopefully the diagonal good and then she'll take another one so it's just a beautiful combination so if you can get that right off the rip usually that's a really strong start what do we got here yep flames of okay is that really what that's called? Faltin? I did not ever think that's what that was called. Okay, so right away I get a suppressor out of them, or her, which is good. And now they have two gems. So the easy way to not get beat right away, I guess I'm going to have to kill her. Because he, he would roll till he gets expert espionage so I was gonna try to have zero action cards in my hand but unfortunately that didn't happen so now I will mess around block the diagonal battle line if he tried and do some damage here of course it didn't kill anybody okay so I got my Maximus again hidden I'm pretty sure Garlor knows I have Maximus so Hiding it's, you know, not absolutely necessary, but it is what it is. Okay, so Destroyer, I am saving Techno for all day. I will not use Techno at all until Destroyer comes out. Because that's always bad when Destroyer comes out. 
All right. Well, that's actually a good spot to drop. I'm just going to kill you, Mr. Claw, here, I think. All right. I'm trying to think. If he does... I don't think he has... He did have Maximus last time. I'm almost positive. Oh, well, let's, uh, let's push the gambit real quick. Let's get some gold out of killing the guy. By the way, if you didn't know, since this new update, which was pretty cool, every time you kill one of your opponent's characters, you get either experience, gold, or their card. Yep, there's the espionage part of it. So he got one of my guys, or one of my cards. I think he just did that because it's so late in the game. Oh, that's why. He wanted to do some extra damage and then drop Sif. Okay. Which still won't kill him, so I'm not sure what what that was. And then I think I just won the game. Alright, well that was anticlimactic there, but... If you kill one of their guys, again, I think you get up to... Gosh, I don't think I've ever gotten a rare. So maybe you only get up to uncommons. But I've gotten a lot of uncommons before from killing their cards. So, like right now, I could have shuffled through and killed a couple more of their guys and just got more experience and stuff. There's Platinum 1, thank you. So if you check right here, check additional rewards, that's where that came from. So you saw that gold explode out of them. I got gold there. I got experience from killing another one. Let's jump into one more um, just to show you... Maybe I can use Maximus on this one, and we'll see. It put me right into a game, so I'm probably facing someone good. I don't know how to pronounce that. Sorry, whoever, if you're watching this video. <laughs> All right, we get to go first, which is always an advantage right now, since Grid is in, or uh, Black Hat and Grid is a nice play. You want to be careful cycling again, because you don't want to show that you have those cards. Maximus and that, but it's not the end of the world. Because if you get them right away and show it off, and then you kind of wait until later, sometimes they forget. At least it seems like that. But always be on high alert. Always on high alert that if you see Maximus, look at that. Wow, what a top deck. Okay, so the cool thing about this now, if I put him in the corner here, Black Cat can only appear here and here, which are both attack line ready spots. Okay, so I'll get the fragment. Black Cat will go there, take that fragment. We're look And Espionage popped up. It's looking pretty, but of course... Wow, is that going to kill her? Yeah, it is. I was going to say, of course they, they, they're going to kill her, uh, which is always mean. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play off here on purpose. And what this is going to do is hopefully they won't kill one of my guys. And Maximus just popped up perfect without being seen. Hopefully they don't kill one of them and I'll drop Espionage and just boost them a little bit. It helps throughout the game. Cool. Okay, so I'm going to do that now and hope that they have a decent amount of action cards. There's one. Okay. So it's not terrible. And I will not need suppressive for a while. Man ape, huh? Let's just keep knocking him around. Let's uh let's get rid of his man ape here. Just because I didn't know what was coming up, and I actually did right there. So I still have Let's see, we're only doing 1,300, which I don't have anyone that would be strong enough to one-shot. And either way, I think they're going to Hawkbuster. Or that. That's not a bad play at all. I like that card. I really do. I think that's a really neat card. A neat card. Did you hear me? What the hell? Okay, here's where you have to plan. If he has Maximus, he can go anywhere on the board right now won't kill me there so it won't kill me there if I place you up here yeah you can't really kill me anywhere and now I'm gonna place you down and have four gems which mean are fragments so I only need a two spot so we're looking strong right now we are looking strong
they have a Hawkbuster, but so do I coming up, which is going to be really nice. Again, I don't know if they have Maximus, but I'm sure. Honestly, if you see an Iron Man leader, be ready for Maximus. It's probably there. Come on, shuffle and show me. Just show me if there's a Maximus. That would be very swell if you did that. Okay, so Iron Man might be a good play for him here. Or not. Jerky uppercutted my Iron Man, which is very mean of him. Oh, snap. Hold on, 1,000. Dang, he could have just beat me if he had Maximus. So he doesn't have Maximus. He could have laid Maximus right here. And it would have took over Captain and Grid and murdered me. Oh, that would have been terrible news. Alright. All my guys are too weak for him to take over anybody and do damage, so... Um, I don't think I need to kill him. If I place here... I have to bank on that. I'm pretty sure he doesn't have him. And if I place him here... No, I'm going to go here. I'm trying to set up my Maximus now is what I'm trying to do without dying here. Oh, Again, uh, so if he did have Maximus, he could have laid it right here. And it would have taken over... Death, Captain, that wouldn't have did enough. Okay. So we're looking pretty good right now. The only thing that bites is uh, damage-wise when he halved everybody. That's a jerk move, but he's kind of sitting dead in the water. So all the action cards are going to start coming out right now. Death is gone. He did have Matt. Why didn't he kill me before? Okay, so he's just dumb, but he finally killed me, so... I don't know. Maybe he just couldn't do math. I'm not sure. Um, but that pisses me off that I just lost. Oh well. You got to see the deck though, and you got to just be careful at all times. Obviously, when you're looking like you're dominating, Maximus can just come around and turn it around. So it's actually good that you got to see what it can do to you, even when you're in a dominating fashion. Like he was getting his ass kicked right there. So. Um, Great job, whoever I just played that with that crazy name. I hope you guys like the deck. Again, I had like, I want to say 20-something straight wins until just now. Uh, so that kind of bites that I just lost. But check it out, guys. If you want to use it, I'll show you one more time. It's really fun to use. You could use... Um, yeah, no, this is probably... This is just a really good deck. So use it up. See what you think. I will catch you guys on the next video. I'm going to do maybe a short video on the update that's coming out tonight blitz is going to be actually i'll just say it now blitz is officially going to be a competitive mode so you'll go 10 ranks of blitz and then you go into competitive blitz which is really cool and once you get through that 10th rank of blitz you get a epic card so you're guaranteed an epic card which is nice so hope you guys enjoyed it sorry i lost that last one but it's good for you guys to see Peace out. See you on the next video.